Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I got an article that I'm gonna read to you all down in y'all, down in the comments down below. I am going to link the article that I have and in there they show a video. I am not gonna show it on this channel. I will be putting up images though. Okay, uh, I'm not gonna show it because I mean it's fighting and you know YouTube gets all extra with fight videos and really anything you know so I'm not gonna be showing the video but I will be putting up images throughout this on the screen okay so oh my goodness y'all when I seen this video I was like oh no I know this I okay uh, I gotta censor myself a little bit for what I was saying but yes we're gonna get into this article because this was crazy y'all okay so what says moment brave canadian okay this is in canada y'all okay moment brave canadian residents fights off two balaclava clad uh burglars in his garage by throwing haymakers and dragging one of the fleeing suspects back to the scene y'all okay you know what before i even you know I'm, I'm gonna get into it i'm gonna summarize and then i'm gonna get into the article okay so you see it it's the it's this white dude right he's over here in his uh, orange shorts or whatnot and you can see two people wearing all black at the balaclava thing that's you know that's essentially like your your criminal face mask your ski mask so these two people come in they're trying to rob him he's like <laughs> that ain't happening today homeboy had hands y'all homeboy had hands i was like i know i know i was like what what's going on yes okay he was he was getting them okay they bit they bandaged him up you know they got him but he was i mean he it was two against one yo this fool got him got them uh so he's beating them up or whatever because they were in his crib then he manages to knock them both down then pulls one out of the you know uh kind of not pull but kind of pushes him shoves him a little bit gets him out of the door locks the door dude somehow manages to unlock the door i mean they're criminals so they probably got in the same way he got he probably got in the same way he got they both got in you know what i mean so then you see um but be, but while he's working and twiddling with the door or whatever you see that he's over here with this other dude he's tussing and whatnot and then you end it with the headlock the owner is now in the headlock and then you got the other criminal who unlocks the door now the video cuts off there from what i've seen because i've seen it on instagram so from what i've seen that's where the video ends but we actually have like images of i think we have an image of the dude and how he looks and everything but we're gonna get into uh, we're gonna get into this article y'all okay so it says a brave montreal resident managed to fight off two balaclava wearing burglars when he found them looting his garage the young man who is yet to be named confronted the thieves while wearing only a pair of orange board shorts basketball short uh the confrontation which was caught on the mount royal homes security cameras took place after 2 a.m the footage shows the suspects dressed in black break into a garage through a door and take out white plastic bags from their pockets the two men then bagged up goods before the resident came hurling in from another room the man uh, lunged at the burglars with his fist and managed to quickly tackle one to the ground both suspects tried to flee by the same door they broke in using uh, uh, broke in using but the resident who can be heard shouting call 911 assuming there's somebody else in the house obviously dragged one of them back into the garage yeah uh the man whose balaclava was removed during the tussle struggled but ended up on his back inside the resident then astutely locked the door in order to prevent the burglar's pals from returning and overpowering him it appears to be an astute move as the garage doors handles door handles was soon seen moving up and down as a second burglar tried to re-enter the resident received numerous blows to the face but was not seriously injured the thieves managed to steal the resident's sister's bag but nothing else was taken the service de police de la villa de montreal 
the service, the police service, the city of Montreal uh, is currently conducting an investigation. Police have not made any arrests in the case and suspects have not been named. So here are some images that I'm going to put up in here and well, real quick, let me see if I can fix that. Cause I don't like how that sounded. Let me see. So we got the service de police de la ville de Montreal. I think that's how you say it. <laughs> police service in the city of Montreal. Um, so anyways, let's get into the pictures. <laughs> okay. Y'all I'm trying to work on my French. Okay. So I'm trying to get something going over here. <laughs> that's why I'm trying to, you know, add in some accents and let me see if I can pronounce this well, because I am trying to work on learning some French today, but anyways, let's continue. So look at this image up here. Okay. So our homeowner is the one in the orange shorts. Okay. Then you got some more. He's over here tussling. You see there's two mass individuals. Okay. So now <clears throat> we have the, so now he was able to take that ish off of him. Okay. And then now we got him on the ground. Okay. I got some other pictures. I'm going to be putting them up. So now this mixed looking dude. Okay. He is one of the perpetrators. He's one of the burglars. Okay, so they managed to get all that stuff off. So hopefully, because like I said, they they haven't arrested anybody yet. Okay, so hopefully they're able to find somebody, uh, find whoever this person is. This was in Montreal. Okay, this is in Canada. So hopefully they were able to find somebody, you know, to maybe they identified them, knew them, brother, whatever. It was like, you know what? I never liked that fool anyways. And I knew he was up to something. Let's get him. Please, y'all. Please, please, please. Let's get this fool. And kudos. Cool toes. Cool toes. Okay. Cool toes. Okay. To homeboy. Because he held his own. I was like, ah, I, you know, when I first, I was like, ah, I mean, who's that? I was like, wait, what's going on? I was like, two against one. Oh, no. I was like, oh, 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 right. Because homeboy held his own, y'all. He held his own. I'm happy that, I mean, they said he didn't get seriously injured, okay? Um, and the picture I was referring to wasn't the owner, it was the other dude, the criminal. Um, but yeah, I'm happy that he didn't get seriously injured because, I mean, that could have add, uh, that could have really ended up really, really bad, okay? And I'm assuming maybe he was able to still kind of, you know, fend them off. And then maybe that's when the wee -oo, wee -oo happened, you know, or, you know, maybe that scared them off or maybe they left beforehand. We don't know. Uh, from Like I said, from the video I seen, I didn't, I didn't see all that. Okay. They cut it off and then that was it, you know. Um, but yeah, um, kudos to him for self-defense, knowing self-defense. This is why myself included, everybody needs to learn self-defense okay because there's only so much you can do okay once you actually learn your body is a tool once you actually learn how to utilize this tool forget it but let me know what you guys think let me know if you actually seen the video and uh, what you think about that hey if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and also leave a comment down below I would also appreciate it if you could go on ebay.com, simply type in Latrice Limited, click on shops, and then you can support me right over there. I have a wide variety of items over there. I have many of my own personal Latrice Limited items, which has candles, bath bombs, soaps, essential oil blends, lingerie robes. I have a whole bunch of stuff. I even have comic books on there, men's ties, action figures, a whole bunch of other stuff as well. Definitely support me on there. Like I said, do not forget to like and subscribe, and thank you.